I would say that they would just love this campus, love the atmosphere here and everything they will love it and they will not regret joining this college ever. Hi guys and today we have a very special guest my brother Shagnik from gyms. So he belongs to the senior most batch there like he joined way back in 2018. Thank you for joining. Thanks Shivam for having me here. And today we will talk about his college that is gyms and his experiences there. So let's begin. Firstly, like how was the first day at your college? Uh, it was way back in 2018 September. We were the first batch so I was generally anxious that what will be the uh, atmosphere like and how will be the college. But it turned out that I was wrong and it was a very warm atmosphere and we were wel welcomed uh, by the teachers, by the faculties at that time present and we enjoyed a lot in our inauguration ceremony and we made friends. It was overall a very warm atmosphere there. It was nothing unfriendly or kind of like where one cannot adjust. It was a very warm atmosphere where one can easily fit in. Okay, so that's definitely a start which every MBBS student would want. Something like a warm one and not something which would bring on too much of nervousness. That's good to hear. Moving on, so the next question would be that how was your college, like how is your college rather different from the other colleges in the state? Uh, to be honest Shivam, uh, I feel the faculty here is way lot better than the other colleges and here education is given a lot lot priority than other things. The patient inflow is good. We have a campus which has a very good, well-infrastructured library, well-equipped gym, a field, everything is there basically what a campus should have. Okay, that's great. And now tell me about the course curriculum in your college. Like, tell me about the attendance factor, how many exams in a year, how puzzled you guys are. Yeah, uh, the course curriculum is same in all colleges, but yeah, the exams are a bit more here because yeah as I told the academics is given a bigger priority and attendance is taken into consideration like people with low attendance can be deferred from giving the examination and uh, we have like every routine examinations bi-weekly examinations and yeah semesters are there as usual okay so by now the audience must have interpreted that the teaching faculty must be really good. So much strict about the exams and so much strict about the attendance. So the teaching faculty has to be good and I really know this that you are really fond about the teaching faculty. So go on, tell me how is the teaching faculty at gyms? Yeah, the clinical subjects such as medicine, OBGYN, pediatrics and uh, radiology to be mentioned, they have the best faculties. All other subjects too have a good faculties but especially can be mentioned about the radiology and the other clinical subjects and they are the teachers are very good it like they are very experienced about their subjects on their fields and they will give you the best guidance on their subjects. So moving on to the next question tell me about the campus there I know it's a private college so it's gonna have a wonderful campus I really want to know about it that what all features do you get? Yeah, a very well-equipped gym is being constructed right now and it will be ready within 2-3 months. The library is the best library that could be there in a campus. It's like, it's marvelous. And there is a field, there are arrangements for indoor sports, everything is there basically. What a campus, or what a best campus should have in West okay. Bengal. And now that's something which every junior really fears about is how's the senior junior relationship. Tell me about whether ragging takes place or not. And I know that you are the senior most batch there. So how are the juniors treated? So tell me about it. Nothing to be uh, feared about or scared about because here the most interesting thing that we share a very good senior junior bond. Uh, we are more than uh, we are more of a friend to our juniors than being a senior. We are a friend to them and here every activity is uh, done with collaborations and joint discussions from both the batches. Here nothing like a seniority plays a role. Here we okay. do it together and we celebrate together. So nothing of that sort. So that's a very friendly atmosphere. So do you like see some kind of negative issues or some competition within the atmosphere? Tell me about it. Competition is there of course. Everywhere it's there. Somewhat competition is also here, 
and negativity there is no such word mentioning okay and now tell me something that uh, whether any dress code is imposed by the management or the seniors of the college something for the juniors to know dress code and anything informal you cannot just come out in shorts or like anything t-shirt and shorts and come in college yeah you have to wear your aprons and you have to come in formals covered shoes are there all these things and tell me about the patient load of the college so everyone knows that gyms is a private medical college so they'll be really keen to know that how's the patient load there i can assure the students who will be coming to our college that yeah the patient load is less than the government medical colleges to be honest but it's more than any other private medical college right now in west bengal and the patient load is enough to for our proper education and proper practice like that was really brave to say that it's uh, better than all the private medical colleges but definitely it would be as you say and moving on tell me about the hostel and the mess food so you recently joined hostel and you must be knowing a lot about it. so tell me about it. I can assure you, uh, Shivam and the juniors will be coming in that the hostel is the best. Hostel is the best in West Bengal currently, and yeah, the mess food is definitely it will not be like our home food or the restaurant, but yeah, it's good. Okay, so basically Something, you get all the facilities in the hostel which a normal student needs from the day-to-day -day life. Yeah, all the facilities are there. There is lift. There is in uh, arrangements for indoor sports and all. Everything is there. Okay, you have indoor sports facilities. What else do you need? You will pass your time like it's liquid. And tell me about the fees there. How? What's the fees for the current year? It's uh, I don't know. I have not updated, but yeah, as far as I know, the currently the fees is eleven lakhs per semester. So that sums up to ninety nine lakhs for the whole course. In government quota, it's around twenty. 5 or 20 to 28 lakhs i don't know i'm not sure about it so basically the audience can actually look for the private uh, management quota as well as the government state quota fees from the official website now let's move on tell me about the transport facilities to the college uh, actually the college is located in a pocket route so basically it would be a bit difficult to avail the public transport it would be better if you come by a private transport and yes uh the train comes there is bajpur station it the train directly comes from sialda and you can avail a auto from the bajpur station to the college directly okay and how are the research opportunities something which uh, the students will not be much keen to know but tell me that how much research is supported by your management yeah there are professors who actually encourage us to conduct researches these icmr papers sts programs we are being encouraged to do that so it would be a great opportunity for juniors if they want in any field they want to research they can get a proper guidance here in gyms okay that's something that's something really good honestly and lastly moving towards the end of the interview like what will be your advice for the juniors who would join your college in the upcoming years i would say that they would just love this campus love the atmosphere here and everything they will love it and they will not regret joining this college ever wow okay so that was the end to the interview and it was lovely knowing thank you shagnik thank you for your time thank you shivam